Uh. You think I'll meet Ghost Mannequin again? Oh, I really hope I do. Partaking in worthless garbage fills you with determination. Hello, boys and girls, and welcome back to an episode of Let's Play 4 Play I Play. That was a friggin' trip. You know what was in here? Yep. Give me all the astronaut food. Oh, what? Oh, I took all the astronaut food. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. I, I, I don't want to know what that implies. Howdy! Evidence of my good friend who trusted me. This is Papyrus, also your mutual friend. Oh, this night finished our training early. Very early. That's so I sent her home. Very home. Uh, now, if you're strongly in for no apparent reason, you should also go there. To her lab! House! I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye! Happy, you, you seem a bit nervous about that. You okay? Uh, okay, whatever. You know what, we're gonna see what this mysterious key, mysterious key do. Use it! <gasps> yeah, wh what? Uh, who knew Steven Universe was was in Undertale? Yeah, let's check it out. <clears throat> Dear Diary, what? <clears throat> Can I do a Steven voice? Am no! Am Am no! I get. I, I haven't watched Steven Universe. Oh my god! I should I should start watching that. I've been meaning to, but I I, I, I just didn't. Okay, <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna try to do this. <clears throat> Shiren's sisters fell down recently. It, it's sad without her sister to speak for her. She's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she, Blueki, and I should all perform together sometime. She seemed to like that idea. Aww. Dearest, dearer diary, I like to buy a new diary for every entry I make. I like to collect diaries. Oh, that, that seems wasteful, man. Steven, uh, how could you? You're wasting all this paper. Dearest Diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. That leaves just Blueki and I. Blueki asked me if I was going to try to become corporeal, too. They sounded so... resigned. Come on, Blueki. You know I never leave you behind. And besides, I never find the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. My darling Diary, I met someone interesting today. Last week, I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Honestly, she was a dork, and she obsessed with those all awful cartoons. She's kind of funny, too. I want to see her again. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is growing fabulously. I have like five now. Dear diary, she was surprised with something today. Sketches of a body that she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I could finally feel like... Myself. After all, there's no way I could be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Blueki. My dreams can't wait for anyone. Oh my. Let's go see... Let's go visit Blueki and see what's up. Hey, Blueki! Oh, okay. Never mind. <sighs> so, Pappy wants me to go to the... Go, he wants me to go to, un, to, to Alphys' lab. And, and do things. Alright. Yep, let me ride in the boat. Take me to Hotland where all the ladies are hot and sexy. At the love shack, get the love shack. At the, the, that, that, that song's go, that goes, the song goes on for like a whole 10 minutes. Speaking just about the love shack, man. It, why? Why do people listen to that song? It's, it, it just repeats the same jarring lyrics over and over again. 
It's it's just it's so boring and yet so catchy. Why? Uh, oh, this freaking lab door is opening for me. What kind of black magic is this? Alright, well. Mysterious as ominous freaking son of a ass freaking door opening for me. I, you know, that's, that's a proper invitation to take me in. Alright. It's not from Malphys. Read it? Sure. It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, you, 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 your support really means a lot to me. Oh, jeez, but that's difficult as it is to say this. As long as I can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I want to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But you don't ever hear from me again. If you want to know the truth, consider the door to the north of this room. You will at least deserve to know what I did. And that's all she wrote. Well, no, that's scary as fuck. No, I'm leaving this place, you know? She's actually, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm actually going to stay for a little bit, because as we know, when most horror stories, shit happens. All right, right, so, wait, oh, I did save. Well, I'm a very compulsive saver, especially when, when scary shit happens. I want to see a lot of jump scares, aren't I? Oh, jeez, this was supposed to be a happy game. Oh, at least the elevator is clear. Maybe this won't be bad at all. Oh no! Why is this happen? Why is this happening to me? Oh god! Well, I died. I'm gonna see that creepy flower again. I gotta do this with me. Right. We get nightmares. I don't like this. I thought this was like a DOS game. Entry number one. This is it. Decided to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I can make a monster so last. Entry number five. I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human soul. I, I believe this is what gives their soul the strength to persist after death. This will, this will to keep the living. The resolve to change fate. Let's call this power determination. I don't like this. I should probably take my headphones off. The true laboratory. Hell no. Hell, very lost power to enter the central door. That's all I could read. You know, I'm just, I'm just gonna take these off. I, I don't wanna listen to this creepy ass music. But at the same time, I do. I'm so conflicted! I'll make chips later. Entry number six. As we're asking everyone outside the city for, for outside the city for monsters have fallen down. Why is came in today? They're still comatose. And soon they'll all turn to dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? And their souls persist after they perish, then freedom might be closer than we all thought. It's being real foggy here. Entry number nine. Things are going well. No, the bodies have turned to dust, so I can't get the souls. 
I told the families I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? Sink. I turn on the sink. Oh, hello there, buddy. Oh, God! Uh, you know, I'll see you guys next time. Let's play for. Oh, God, that guy's glitching out. Bye!